Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Macy, and if you're new here, I make videos on my cozy daily life, my tech and desk setups, and I also document my creative endeavors. Today is just another day in my life where we'll be organizing my desk setup. As you can see, my desk has gotten pretty chaotic, so I wanted to take some time today to organize my space and give everything a proper home, and also bring you guys along. On the internet, we always see desk setups in their final form, and it's not always representative of what it's like in real life. For me, making content definitely encourages me to keep my space organized, but there are a lot of days where life just becomes really overwhelming and I have a lot of things going on and that really reflects in my physical environment. And this past week was one of those weeks. As a result, my desk setup kind of got a little bit crazy. So I wanted to spend some time today to organize my setup and bring you guys along on the journey. So let me quickly show you what is the situation with my desk setup. So this is what the situation looks like currently. We have dirty cups, we have makeup lying around. It's definitely indicative of how chaotic my past week was. So what I think I'm gonna do first is just empty everything on my desk so that I can organize everything, wipe it down and clean it, and give everything their proper home. So after clearing my desk, it makes it so much easier to really visualize how I want to structure and organize all of my things. I wipe down my desk with a mixture of dish soap and water, and then after wiping everything down, I repositioned my desk shelf and also added the desk tray. I really like the desk tray because it slides perfectly in the desk shelf, and it acts as extra storage for things that I use all the time, such as my USB-C adapter, my lipsticks and lip glosses and chapstick, my air pods which I use whenever I'm editing or just chilling, hand cream, foundation cushion, and also my phone wallet. Next to that compartment, I also slid in my journals, and I also wired in a USB-C cable so that I can charge my iPad while storing it in the desk shelf. On the left side of my desk, I recently installed this desk drawer which is perfect for storing my skincare. I wasn't planning on storing my skincare at my desk because I always believed that it should be in my bedroom. But the reality is a lot of the time I end up coming to my desk setup to get ready and I would end up just bringing my skincare with me. On the bottom right of my desk, I have my file cabinet, but I don't really have many files, so I actually store my camera gear in here. Having a designated drawer for all of my camera gear has been a lifesaver because as a content creator, I'm always looking for my camera stuff. So having a designated spot where I can be assured that all of my camera gear lies there has been really helpful. On the top drawer of my file cabinet, I have my Orbit Key Nest, which is perfect for on the go. So I include my extra chargers, cables, and another portable charger. And this is great for traveling too. So let's say I'm studying in the cafe, I can just grab my nest and take it with me and I'll have all the necessary charging gear. I have extra post-it notes that I use frequently for to-dos, extra cases for my phone that I like to change often, my Polaroid camera, gaming mouse, and nail polishes that I use frequently. So after organizing all of my drawers, it's time to tackle my cable management. It has a very long power adapter in the back. I organized all of my wires with Velcro and neatly organized it with the cable management solution. This cable management bar has been a huge lifesaver and I highly recommend it if you are desperately needing to organize your cables. Now that cable management is out of the way, let's start organizing the things on our desk. So this is a little break from our desk organization session, but I wanted to take this time to share with you guys my very first 
product collab and it's with Grove Maeve. We collaborated together to create this desk mat and it is amazing. The color that we chose for the desk mat is in this very subtle powder pink and it is the perfect warm accent to add to your cozy desk setups or your minimal desk setups. It honestly fits any desk setup aesthetic, which is really nice. It doesn't really seem that pink in person. It's more of like a really nice beige with pink undertones. My previous desk mat was like a really light gray finish and I always wanted one that was beige and pinkish. So I'm really happy with how this turned out. So it's made with a matte linoleum material. On the back side, it has a cork finish which is really awesome because it matches the rest of my setup with my cork accents. What's really awesome about the cork backside of this desk mat, it actually prevents the desk mat from sliding all over your desk. So if you are moving your keyboard around or if you're using your hands to move things on your desk, this will actually stay in place. And it's really durable and thick. It's easy to clean. I've spilled coffee all over it before and cleaned it up with no problems. This desk mat is on a limited run for one week starting today. So if you're interested in picking up one of these desk mats, it's it's running for $70 on Grove Meets website. The link to it is in the description below, so be sure to check it out. And if you guys support this desk mat launch, it would give me an opportunity to create a lot more awesome products for your cozy desk setups in the future. So let's get to unraveling this desk mat and seeing how it looks like on my desk. The desk mat adds necessary structure to the desk and makes it so visually appealing. So let's start organizing my desk and putting all of my accessories on it. And with that, here's the final desk setup. After a day of decluttering and organizing, I feel so peaceful knowing that everything in my space has intention and brings me joy. Removing unnecessary clutter and giving everything that I use daily a proper home can make such a significant difference even though it's such a subtle change. I'm enjoying the new ways that I organize my space and I know that it's really going to help me in my daily routines. So we went from my desk setup looking like this, to looking like this, where everything has a unique spot and home. And with that, here's a little montage of my morning routine at my cozy and organized desk setup.
Thank you so much for watching this video and joining me today as I organize my desk. I hope that you enjoyed my updated desk setup tour for 2022. And I hope that this video motivated you to take care of your physical environments because it seriously does wonders to improve your mental health and your mental clarity. It's definitely something I need to work on myself. So yeah, I really had fun making this video. And don't forget to check out my desk mat launch. The details will all be in the description below and I'll also be posting pictures of it on my Instagram. If you happen to pick up one of these desk mats be sure to tag me on Instagram and show me your setup I really love seeing how you guys take inspiration from my desk setup videos it really makes me so happy and honestly makes my days I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and as always stay cozy and I'll see you in the next one